Can you believe this fucking weather? I mean, shit, it was 60 yesterday. I'm going to have to look for another way out of here. Okay, I'll wait here in case Claire decides to go down or someone tries to come up. Um, okay. Well. No one thought... Wait, what about Mr. Scary Mouth down there? Didn't he bring a ladder? Whatever. Is that snow? Oh yeah, it is winter, okay. Well, I think I found our way out. I absolutely love what they've done here. The view is just super. <laughs> really? You're doing that? Good idea. All I need now is something to pry these boards off. Ah, I need a crowbar. Okay. Uh, Claire, um, I for some reason think you have a crowbar for dealing with this Miller guy. I hope I am right. I'll ask you first. You're closer. I'm going to have to look for another way out of here. Okay, I'll wait here in case Claire decides to go down or someone tries to come up. If Claire decides to go down, what? I do you think she's stupid? Like I'm pretty sure she'll notice that there's no staircase. Loaded. Okay. Let's talk to Claire. Hey, what the hell was that noise? The stairs fell apart. If you're planning on leaving, don't take the stairs. I'm trying to find another way out. Ah, oh, great. Now how the hell are we supposed to get the body out of here? I don't know. You guys will figure it out. <laughs> you just don't give a fuck. I am dealing with a lot of ladies in games who just don't give a fuck. Nothing in the fridge. Alright. Oh, I can run? How do you run? Oh. You run weird. <laughs> you run very weird. <laughs> Your running amuses me. Except that it's like no faster at all compared to the walking speed. Alright. I will not do anything with my camera apparently. Look at these again. I absolutely love what they've done here. The view is just super. Did you ask her to deliver that line like that? Because if so, kudos. I don't say that word much, but that deserves it. Run! Oh, pile of junk. You are a useful pile of junk, thank you. Um, you know, put the name on that next time. Alright, we have to go there. We have to escape. Run! Run! I still like that. So unnecessary. Yes, we have exit. Damn, she just kicked the shit out of that door. And good. Not good. It looks like I'm gonna have to do this the hard way. Uh, jump? Yeah, jump. Nice parkour. <laughs> I 
I like you. God, Miller, are you okay? <laughs> Do you think he's okay? Yeah. <laughs> he's fine. Everything about your face just now was terrifying. Um, I'm gonna leave. And I hope I never see you or your terrifying face again. Oh. Oh, the... Oh! Interesting. Do I have a flux capacitor? No, that would have been awesome. So you feel the need to show her jump off the thing and land on a dumpster, but no little tiny driving scene for transitions? I guess I should be glad. They get annoying. I can look at the cop car. Run to it! Thank God I'm not driving that piece of crap. This is your car! I had to turn off steam shit. Okay. This way! You're not running. I told you to run. I can't take the elevator. Now you run. Good. I don't need that. I will. One day. I will. Can you use it? Oh, I can go in there. Okay. Close. I guess I have to go to the only one that's lit up. Well, that transition was unnecessary as well. Oh wait, no. Eventually, that's gonna get interrupted and I'm gonna have to solve puzzles. I know how this works. Why am I in here? It's my boss's coffee mug. Should I? Nah. Yeah. Not until the camera's off, then piss in it. Fuck your boss. I bet he's an asshole. Well, why can't I go in there at all? If there's nothing in there. I have no use for napkins. That won't work. Nobody restocked the cups. That is very rude. Well, I guess it's late. But still, bad work advocate. Ethicate? What the fuck is that word? Film goes in here. It's the evidence shoot. What? I don't need to do that. Really? It's a picture of film. Okay. Oh, in here. Okay. Hey! You got comfortable fast. Why did you take so long getting here? You're the only one with a 4x4. Four four. Christ, I don't even want to go there. I mean, what is it with these idiots who buy 20 lottery tickets anyway? I mean, do they really have to waste everyone's time? God, they piss me off. I just wanted a pack of gum, too. Hey, last time I saw you, you were limping to your car. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. It's just my ego. It got hurt more than me, I think. I like the action figure on your desk. So what are you up to? I started the report. I figured you were too pooped to do it. You know, Miller, you do have your moments. Oh, I almost forgot. Is everything okay with your girlfriend? Oh yeah, forget about it. She knows now it's a big misunderstanding. But just don't answer my cell phone again, please. I promise. You caused trouble. Anything I can do to help with the report? Actually, yes. I need Claire's preliminary report to help me out. I'm not going down there. She might lock me up in one of the drawers and leave me there. Also, I need the pictures you took, so could you please drop the camera and the evidence shoot in the hallway? Well, okay. See you later. I knew I had to do that. Fucker. What's in here? Ooh. It's a paper cutter. I know that. You can 
be like the faculty and use that as a blade. A plastifier. This little machine can be very practical. Is, is that a real thing? This is used to lift fingerprints. That's a real thing. But This is used to lift fingerprints. Yeah, I was talking about the brush. What the fuck is a plastifier? I gotta look that up. And nothing else here. Alright. Well, I need to go talk to Claire and drop off the film, which I already tried to do. I have a message. You have a present? That's more important. Oh, never leave home without it. Hello, Victoria. <clears throat> this is Todd. I heard about the fifth murder. I expect a full report on my desk tomorrow morning. Yes, you would, wouldn't you? Oh no, your boss wants to know about the dead person that's your job. What the hell is your problem? Oh. These must be one through four. That is disturbingly realistic. Oh, it's probably because it's a real photo with bad Photoshop right here. Okay. You know, they got better at the Photoshop. And they got a little worse. Now, they didn't even try. I'm just fucking around. Those are actually pretty grim. Good job. Good job. Yeah, I'm done looking at those. Okay. Dead faces. I'm not squeamish or anything. I just don't like looking at them. It's fucking grim, man. Alright. Take my fucking film. Like you're supposed to. Good. Oh yeah. Open the fucking present. That's not opening it. Nope. Well, I should read it. Christmas present for Victoria's dad. Oh. I shouldn't open that at all. Wait a minute. Oh, wait. Let's see. The journal. What do I gotta do? I'm not gonna read all that. Well, I did not find a mission log or whatever, so let's see if we can find Claire. Oh no! <laughs> not you! Agent McPherson. Officer Tate? Agent Ashby wants to see you. She's waiting for you at the morgue. All right. So, how did you guys get the body down? Me and some of the forensic guys set up a ladder where the stairs fell. Oh, well, I hope no one got hurt. Nope, I know what y'all mean, though. That place was as stable as lemmings near a cliff. Go away and never come back. Fuck. I quit this job. You stretch that neck. The morgue. Oh, there's so many ways to go. Is this the bathroom? Oh! There's no dog flipping switches, though. A reanimator deck. They're wicked. <laughs> they made a card game off of reanimator? Oh, that'd be fucking awesome. Look in the trash. My god, it stinks in there. Eh, uh, nothing in here. Alright, let's not fuck around and go talk to Claire. That's weird. My access code doesn't work. Uh-oh. There's a plot. They secretly don't want you to know what's going on. Ah, here's the bathroom. I never use mixed public washrooms. They're just too... icky. You know, you have a point. That's... I know people who do terrible things in those places. Um, maybe I'll find the clue in here. 
check the cameras. Nope. So the only things of interest in here are the deck of cards and oh, the calendar. That makes sense. Miss December. Wow. Even God would say I didn't make those. <laughs> you have a one-liner for everything. You are like, I like you. I hope you don't die a tragic death. Well, so I let's try again. Maybe double clicking it will work. That's weird. My access code doesn't work. All right, back upstairs. We'll go bitch to the scary man. Hey. Oh no, not you. Fuck talking to you. Yes, I. I guess that's oh, the hint no. that I can't talk to him. Yes, I know, but. Try the door. Why did I try the door? The yes. boss's office. It's locked, of course. Oh, that's why I didn't try it before. No. I um. That... You. I have no choice but to talk to you. Yes. Taking a breather? Yeah, it's the damn weather. Depressing as hell. I need to gather more energy before I go back out there. You're still on patrol? Unfucking fortunately, yeah. Well, hang in there. I'll try. Unfucking fortunately, I thought that your face still terrifies me. Keep your face turned away from the camera, please. Yes, I know, but fuck your phone call. Tell me your secrets. Yes, but... What are you doing? What, what are you... No. Okay. I thought that... I better leave Miller alone. It looks like he's got his hands full. Uh, just when I yes. need his dumbass, I need to... Man, I shouldn't call him a dumbass. I kind of like him. No. Uh... Oh! No. I can do this forensically. This is used yes, to lift I... fingerprints. Take it. This is used to lift fingerprints. No, well... Yeah, I can... Yes, I know, but... Find the... Uh... <laughs> I'm a dumbass. Okay, so I'm supposed to use the card. I don't know my code. What's my code? What? Ah, oh, man! Don't tell me you gotta memorize my. Okay, let's try that. Five, eight, three. Alright, so oh, we'll try using it again. No? Shit! What's my code? I need an access card. I have an access card. Alright. Well, it's not number. Vodka? Vodka. Hmm. Okay, I can do this. You know, I didn't think the Umbrella Corporation designed your morgue. Alright. V. O. D. K. A. There we go. Really, really confusing. Hey, there's that girl. Hey, Claire, get that preliminary lab work done? As a matter of fact, I'm not quite finished. However, I have enough to brief you on if you have the time. For you, always. Okay, here goes. The victim's blood revealed high levels of alcohol. Also, I found traces of rohypnol, which is also known as the date rape drug. This explains why there was no apparent struggle throughout the assault. The assault started in the first room where she was beaten. She probably fell when you found the spot of blood. She was then carried into the next room. The killer ripped off her clothes and beat her again. She definitely was unconscious at this point. He let her bleed on the floor until he had enough blood to write the messages you found using the luminol.
killer then cleaned off the messages. Obviously, he knew we would find them. He then dragged the victim by her hair along the hallway and stopped to hang up his coat. He finally brought her into the bathroom. The cause of death was drowning. He forced her head under the water until death ensued. Like the other victims, she was killed before the mutilations. She was stabbed nine times and then eviscerated from the lower sternum to the lower abdomen. What are you thinking? I'm thinking these mutilations will get worse. It wasn't part of his MO for the first three victims. They were found beaten and drowned, not like this. Do you think he'll change his MO in the near future? No, I don't think so. Drowning his victims seems to be his focus. That stage in the assault is very important to him. No, the stabbing business is from something else. I have a feeling that if we knew what it was, we would catch the son of a bitch. Also, he covered the face of the fourth victim and now this one. This strongly suggests that he knew the last two victims. I'll ask Miller to correlate the last two victims' info. How about you? Did you come up with anything interesting? Yes, I got a partial that doesn't belong to the victim. Very nice. Did you compare it to the partial you found from the fourth crime scene? No, not yet, but I'll let you know if I can compare them. After all, they are only partials. What about the stuff I found? Anything worth mentioning? We know that our killer has black hair, if it was he that hung his coat on the nail. It might have been a junkie for all we know, but it doesn't matter. We can use the hair for DNA comparison and place him at the scene of the crime. I sent the fibers to the FBI labs to see if they can find anything unusual or unique about them. I've been meaning to ask you, did you call her? Call? Oh, no, I didn't. I just don't have the courage. Can we not talk about this now? Sure, but promise me that you will call her. Okay, okay, I promise. Okay, sweetie, I'm out of here. Don't forget my beautifully handwritten report. It's on the table. Come on, Velma, you can't forget Daphne at Christmas. I know she rejected you, but you're still friends. I know it's probably her daughter. But, whatever. This... Is that guy supposed to be Jack the Ripper? He looks like a ceramic Jack the Ripper. Hello? Hi, sweetheart. Hey, Dad. I just heard on the news. Another one? Yes, another one. Is everything okay with you? I'm okay. I'm just really tired of this case. It's going nowhere fast. I hate this passiveness. I think it's starting to get the better of me. Well, before that actually happens, why don't you come here and rest? A little R&R &R won't do you any harm. You can use the jacuzzi to relax and put your thoughts in order. And it's almost Christmas. I have a little gift for you. Oh, really? Well, I have the gift you wanted. Are you sure you want it? It seems a little ordinary. Hey, <laughs> it's what I wanted. So, are you coming to the house? Yeah, sure. Okay, honey. I'll see you soon. Dad? Yes, honey? Thanks. You're more than welcome. See you in a bit. Bye. What a nice conversation. Ah. Uh, well, I guess I'm going to see what we did. I still like how you run. I can't leave now. I still have some work to do. Oh yeah, I gotta give him the paper. Yes, I... Get out the fucking phone. I got stuff for you. No, well... Yes, I know. Here's Claire's report. Hey, Miller, one last thing. Can you correlate the data of the fourth victim and the fifth to see if we're overlooking something? Sure. I'll run them through the database. Thanks for the report. Yes, I... Okay. Now I think I can go. No, well... We can leave! Where's my mouse? There it is. Pat's house. Who the fuck is Pat? <laughs>